SARS-CoV-2 is a coronavirus, one of a group of viruses named for the characteristic spike proteins on the surface of their infectious particles. These spikes can resemble a crown-like halo or solar corona surrounding the virus itself. The spike acts like a grappling hook to start an infection. It is a flexible structure formed from three identical proteins bound together and has a dense covering of sugar molecules called glycans, which can act as a protective shield to prevent antibodies from binding. At the tip of the spike is a region called the receptor binding domain, or RBD. As its name suggests, the RBD binds to a receptor, a feature the virus can recognize on host cells. The primary receptor for SARS-CoV-2 is a protein called angiotensin converting enzyme 2, or ACE2, which is found on cell surfaces. Binding to ACE2 is the first step in SARS-CoV-2 infecting a cell. As the spike flexes, the RBD shifts in a hinge-like motion, moving the spike between closed and open states. The spike must be in the open state for the RBD to bind to ACE2. Mutations that cause the spike to be more open more often can increase infectivity. Antibodies that bind to the RBD can stop it binding to ACE2, which blocks infection. Some antibodies bind more easily to the open spike. Mutations that cause the spike to spend more time in the closed state may help the virus evade our immune responses, but at the expense of limiting its infectivity. Being more open or more closed is a trade-off for the virus.